for my for a channel advisor uae and advisor uae facebook page uh, so this is merita deva sahaya business host in advisor uae uh, so during this covid 19 situation uh, we are uh, getting a lot of questions and queries uh, through my whatsapp and uh, through our page and uh, website so uh, now we are connected with uh, mr vikas kotwal who is a cii uh, financial planner in advisor uae he have uh, more than 20 years of experience in financial planning and wealth accumulation so i don't want to take much time so we are directly getting to the question okay uh, thank you so much for connecting with, uh, with us mr vikas vikas kotwal sir thank you uh, my question is uh, during this covid 19 so people are very struggle in uh, financially they are very struggle nowadays so how can they manage that and hope of this situation currently well uh, how people should cope up with situation of course it's yeah of uh, the unique situation which has arisen in the world and uh, the last at least 40 days uh, most of the world uh, is un- <clears throat> locked up we have learned any okay. habit to be built is uh, taking at least 20 days so we have crossed that so i'm hopeful and uh, i'm sure that uh, people are thinking of the future ahead and how to handle and manage this uh, situation even now we are thinking how we can going to manage because we are into business of uh, interaction that's uh, meeting people and uh, we are also changing it necessity is the mother of invention we are uh, taking it route taking webinar route taking meeting and demand is high i believe that uh, nothing is permanent in the history also yeah. if you go back we have seen mm. not of such kind but economically we have seen things have gone bad in mm. depression even in 2008 we were in uae we have seen that was another story that was a real estate impact on the economy and yeah. uh, people had to lose their jobs yeah of such this way even that was worse than uh, this situation at this time at least the governments are empathetic uh, they are support you and they have given lot of packages to support each and every individual in their own uh, way that time it was it just happened and people lost their jobs and many of them left their cars behind on the airport took a ticket and left but what we noticed after year or year and a half the situation reversed back to a good economy and uh, 2010 to 2015 uh, we all witnessed uh, one of the best economy uh, here of course but globally it was happening good and however the economy was uh, slowing down and top of that the covid has put up great impact almost it looks like an a depression uh, status but it's not permanent it will yeah. uh, the way the world is uh, united to fight this corona virus uh, yeah sure the same, yeah. uh, the whole world is going to fight and revive back the economy globally because it's not particular city state country i think whole world is impacted by this a lot and uh, my suggestion is survive some of for another one or two months by june things will start slowly moving back and yeah. uh, people even the employees must be thinking or they must be uh, getting support from the governments also to support their employment uh, because nobody would want their uh, country and the laborers to move on from the city yeah. to, uh, to the places is very difficult to recruit and challenge to hr so yeah. people are trying to resolve the matter it's a matter of month or two what yeah. has happened has happened during this time it's only patience but for the future we need to definitely restructure strategize how yeah. to go ahead for the best future uh, in life 
there will be totally shift in uh, perspectives and uh, is not about going to be money game there will be a totally balance which uh, we will definitely do one webinar which we are planning to do it hopefully that will resolve you few more points and ideas how to cope up with this threat yeah definitely it's a good answer and uh, uh, hope uh, they are all agreed with this answer uh, thank you so much for this answer actually uh, like uh, uh, you know this covid 19 situation uh, most of the uh, uh, industry was very low i think uh, uh, there are some uh, uh, head cut like uh, not no job security in UAE not only in UAE most of the country uh, now they are very they are struggled a lot uh, regarding their uh, job security and all so it's okay it's all temporary uh, and uh, okay let let uh, let us overcome on that uh, cases uh, beyond that case you know what is that uh, what in what way we can save our uh, uh, money and save our energy and all with this situation. Um, forget about that uh, COVID nineteen and uh, lockdown anything. So what what in what way we can um, back up our situation? What we can do? We can do what we were doing. We need to do some changes on little changes on the systems. What placed on us. We need to see the different platforms or maybe a different way, total approach on uh, approaching on the same business. Let's say one professional of the same task is not going to suddenly do something else, but revive it to a new dimension. And uh, yeah. days, everybody would have given a good thought over it. And I believe uh, IT is going to play a big role. There are a lot of businesses which may be handled uh, through online services. There will be a lot of part-time opportunities. There will be a lot of service happening. There will be a lot of, uh, of small-scale industries who will be employing part-timers more than the uh, full-time job workers. I think one way the opportunities are going to be more on the platform, maybe a little little money but it will add to a piggy bank and uh, we need to keep an eye on such resources and authentic resources but i strongly believe things will come back to normalcy after july uh, things will move on in the right direction okay okay that is great so nowadays, you know, most of the systems is changed to the digitalized, like, uh, you know, uh, education system also is changed to the uh, digitalized. So is it really both, is this uh, really um, like uh, overcome through the real problem? Is the really uh, the result, you know, uh, is it really work out, you know, digitalization, full digitalization in uh, education sector, in uh, any other meetings or is it workable or uh, it's okay like that for, for your opinion well dig digitalization was not uh, started now it was long before it was trying to get introduced to each and every one and everyone uh, supposed to be part of it anyways uh, covid 19 post covid 19 it will look like uh, 50 50 people will try to solve resolve their issues online and uh, understand there, if there is no point of driving to Bartabai, if I could solve it out, uh, over the conference, things will be okay. One way, it's going to help more on the environmental uh, way and it will be giving in scope for the different industries. So maybe there will be a switch to the industrial, but employment will not go if if uh, things are coming through the it then the it professionalism will uh, the employment will go more and it's not going to be very difficult task for anyone who is not even known to the it hardly takes few days to understand and uh, be part of it okay so things will go that way 
okay okay you told me about that um, piggy bankism right uh, so can you please tell me about more about piggy bankism is it really uh, good or we can invest money in any anywhere no piggy, or piggy bankism is good i think piggy bankism is not about uh, investing Piggy bankism is uh, a concept which, from uh, I had put it in my book, is uh, through is uh, prior to Babylon era. It was a concept which was taught by the young parents, and even now it's existing. Any young parent is introducing to their toddlers uh, piggy-shaped boxes to set aside the money which they've been uh, gifted to, and slowly they see that getting piled up. However, it doesn't get, but uh, the concept was training people, the toddlers from the childhood to set aside some money. Pinky Pankism concept, what I was talking about is, is a mandatory, is a compulsion, or uh, it should be integral part of life because uh, today we see no asset-based people even are struggling. Uh, recently, we came across a news which was very shocking, uh, the industrialist. One of them in the UAE did suicide. Mm. But because there is a crunch in the cash flow, it's not about the person was poor. The person may be having million dollars of assets uh, in various yeah. uh, countries. But what happens is to manage anything needs a liquidity. So the liquidity comes more with the piggy bankism. That's what what I want. I put it up. However, uh, it's not in, yet in the dictionary, but piggy bankism, I think, will take a, a big, will play a big role post COVID 19. At least three to six months of financial arrangements must be there with each and every one. This is what we learned the lesson. Yeah, thank you so much. Actually, I have another question uh, Are we stuck in a save and spend rut? So, this is also one question. And uh, what is the pyramid of financial? And also, uh, I believe during this lockdown of 40, 30, mm -hmm. 40 days, we hardly had a chance to spend. And uh, nobody felt of like uh, bored of not spending, you know. So we have learned already. I recommend or I suggest people to continue with at least most of the habits which we have developed more on organic food, not unnecessarily spending money on, uh, on different items, more on the luxury. Why not the needful and specific goals? We keep it in the mind and move ahead. That will save a lot of money and that saving automatically will help in the specific financial goals or in most of the dreams, uh, uh, aspirational goals. But save and spend, what I used to say is, most of the time we save a little bit, but we get impulsive in the market when we are moving around in the malls. Let's say if I had been in the last 30 days, every day, one visit to a mall, definitely end up buying, even if it's a hundred dirhams or 1000 dirhams item, we get impulsive of buying. Or we see neighbors are looking at, at the moment, we have not seen what's going on. What we understand is a well, good quality food, a nice, uh, entertainment programs at home or any educational programs people are doing research people are doing a lot of analysis and if they continue with the habit which is already been developed and if they don't change their mind continue with okay. the same pattern i strongly believe the saving pattern will increase to a maximum extent and it will help the entire world the society okay sir I think uh, we are done. Uh, thank you so much, sir, for this uh, 